visualization is a useful tool to use when doing process simulations. In this particular case, I want to visualize the phase behavior. In order to plot the phase equilibria, I move to Plot, TPXY, to arrive at this dialog box. ChemCAD uses convention that any input that has a green description requires an input by the user. Anything that is black has default values. In this case, I want to plot the phase behavior of isopropanol and water. I can choose constant pressure or constant temperature. In this case, I'll choose constant pressure. And I'll do this calculation at 20 psi. I need to select the type of reports or the visualization that I want. In this case, I'm going to select a text report, XY diagram, TXY diagram, and activity coefficients. Because I have selected not to invoke the pointine correction, I cannot plot fugacity coefficients. First up is the text report. I'm plotting isopropanol and water using the NRTL solution model. The NRTL solution model parameters are given. The table consists of the bubble point temperature, in this case the specified pressure, liquid composition isopropanol, vapor composition isopropanol, activity coefficient isopropanol, and activity coefficient of water. Again, because I did not invoke the pointine correction, the fugacity coefficient ratio is 1. I can plot the XY diagram. Isopropanol being more volatile is the composition that's plotted. Vapor phase, liquid phase, and the equilibrium composition. You'll see that this binary has an azeotrope. If I want to focus in on a certain area that is to zoom, I can hold down the left mouse button, highlight the area that I want to zoom in on, release, and get a zoomed in plot of the phase behavior. In this case, the azeotrope is nominally 0.67 mole fraction isopropanol. I can zoom out. Moving to the next graph, this is the TXY temperature, composition of isopropanol, liquid phase, vapor phase, equilibrium concentrations are across any isotherm. Again, there's an azeotrope. I can highlight this area just as I did with the YX diagram. Identify that the azeotrope is, of course, nominally 0.67 isopropanol. I can zoom out, move to the next. These are the activity coefficients. Isopropanol in red, water in green. I can close these. So, in order to visualize the phase behavior, plot TPXY, choose component 1, component 2, whether it's going to be isobaric or isothermal. In this case, I chose isobaric. Enter the pressure. There are defaults for these entries. Choose the output and arrive at the phase behavior. In this case, the text table, the XY diagram, the TXY diagram, and the activity coefficient. 
This tip showed you how to plot phase equilibria. Thank you for using ChemCAD. For more tips, please visit chemstations.com. My name is Chip Howitt.